it's about trying to get that little bit of spark, that little bit of inspiration. You know what, I remember when I was at school and you had that one person that came and did an assembly at school and you just went, yeah, I want to do that. So one of the most important things about uh, this whole program, what we're trying to do here, is uh, inspire young kids around the world. I've always had this philosophy that, you know, we get bombarded with um, all these different animals all over the world, all the sort of really uh, charismatic animals like rhinos and elephants and pandas and tigers and snow leopards and whales. But sometimes kids forget about what's in their own backyard. It's just a real sort of interactive experiment that we're trying to do. The great thing for me is to know that there's loads and loads of kids watching in their schools right now, all getting prepped, all waiting to cross with their questions to us here in the Sabi Sands in South Africa. This is what Wild Safari Live is all about. And, uh, I'm pretty excited. Welcome to Wild Safari Live. My name's Hayden Turner. We are broadcasting from the African bush all the way across the world. But I came up with this idea and I thought, wouldn't it be brilliant if we could get some schools organized to watch this and we could talk to you and you can ask us questions. Keelan, okay, fantastic. Hey buddy, everyone that's watching there at St. Joseph's versus School wants to know what big animals we've got here. Well, I'm just going to show you a big animal. Does anyone know? These are called, these are African buffalo or Cape buffalo. Okay, now I've got a really special surprise for you. Do you want to go and see it? You sure? You want to go? I can't hear you. Ah, oh, wow. Okay, 60 different schools have said yes at the top of their voices. I'm going to take you and show you my favourite animal on this reserve. And this particular animal I saw on my first day. And he is very special to me. This is cute. You're the next custodians of the planet. You're the next keepers of the planet. Pete and I can't do it forever. And all the other people, they need to pass it on to somebody. And it could be you. It's really important to know that it's not all about lions, tigers, whales and bears. It's also about everything that's in your own backyard. 